welcome back to my channel. This is such a weird day because I literally just got off of a plane after flying from LA to Atlanta, layover for two and a half hours from Atlanta to DC. This pimple came with me and I'm staying at a hotel and they were completely booked last night and I can't check in. I can't even get two hours of sleep. I just wanted two hours of sleep. Luckily on the last flight, it was not full at all. So I got to actually like lay down because nobody was in my row. It's just so annoying because I don't even have on like real clothes. I'll show y'all, I have on a Lululemon zip up, a leather jacket, cause it wouldn't fit in my bag, sweats. What do you do when you're in DC? It's beautiful here, I've never been here. It's absolutely beautiful. So beautiful. Like it's so beautiful, it looked like some racist stuff went down here. Like it had to have. It is the only way we survive the beauty. <laughs> I asked on my Instagram for some suggestions for things that I should do. And one that I really liked was going to the African American Museum and going to U Street because that is um, where the civil rights memorials are. I wanna see that. Come with me this morning while I explore DC. Trust me, this vlog might not make a lot of sense because I am exhausted, but I'ma try. Okay, I'm on U Street right now. I finally see some black people, that's cool. But I don't see a memorial anywhere. Like, I think maybe it was like up that street and I missed it, but I don't see nothing. I guess I gotta Google it, give me a second. All right, everybody kept saying I have to go to Ben's Chili Bowl. They have chili and burgers there. But I'm not doing that with y'all this time, okay? <laughs> Plus, chili doesn't really entice me, honestly, enough to eat meat. Uh, the hot chicken in Nashville, now, worth it. I just can't really imagine chili being worth it to me. And I'm really trying to be like a really good vegetarian. Pescatarian whatever some vegetarians eat fish but anyway i'm not doing the chili with y'all but it was cute and michelle obama on the side that's real cute but i'm not doing it <laughs> there are so many places to eat i'm not really hungry but you know you just want to eat something because you're in a new place um but i do spot a pete's coffee so i'm gonna pop a squat right here get one of my favorite black ties and figure out my next move all right y'all you know i hate sightseeing but i don't want to disappoint my kids i can't tell them i came all the way out here and not saw anything so i'm about to head to the um washington monument to take a look around the white house is over there too always face the light jazz <laughs> i'm headed to the washington monument um, the White House is over there too, so it'll be interesting to see that kind of stuff in person, you know. Obama and not in there, but it's okay. It's, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> it's not. It's really not. I'm gonna say that DC is beautiful 100 times during this vlog. Uh, excuse me! Anyway, I'm gonna say that DC is beautiful 100 times because it just is. It is. Okay, I'm walking. I can see the tip of the Washington Monument. Why can't I say this? Like, this is my last name. Damn, that makes me think about slavery. Mm. Um, the tip of the Washington Monument right here. Just the tip. <laughs> Giggity. Anyway, I'm silly. Y'all know. See the tip there? It's pretty tall. I 
made it. If, can I just get a good shot? Oh my gosh. tall. I googled this uh, monument today and it said that it was based off of Egyptian architecture because you know black people we we've been inspiring the culture for a minute I don't know if y'all know but yeah pretty pretty nice that explains the pyramid at the top oh man granddaddy almost just ran me over it's beautiful it's all square and stuff I mean what do you say when you see it nice can we rename it or is that not a possibility? Oh, it's too late, okay. There's a building across the street. I don't know what it is, but it's so beautiful and I'm gonna find out. This beautiful building is the National Museum of African American History and Culture. I feel just, you know, so disrespectful because I have on sweats. <laughs> but hey, you know, at least I'm out. And they, you know, they don't allow video cameras in museums typically. I can actually visit without a pass because it's a weekday. So I'm going to go inside and look around and probably cry because that's how much I care about my people and being black. And that's how much pride and joy I have in my history and my culture. And then I'll tell you guys about it and probably fake cry. Let's see how beautiful it is on the inside. The pictures on them like online are stunning. Good news, y'all. You can record in here, cause you know black people, we cool like that. <laughs> yeah, I saw a lady with the full on video camera and I was like, can we record? And they said yes. So I'm going up to the top level to start there, see what kind of cool stuff I can run into in regards to history and all that. Walking around like the visual art area. There's some beautiful art in here. If I talk more, I'm gonna burst a tear, so I'm gonna just stop here.
there's so much to see here and the views from here are crazy good um when I first like walked into the museum I was like okay but the details and like all of the history that they put together is just really well put together and it's stunning I'm not and that was just the first floor y'all <laughs> um I think I'm gonna finish looking through the museum and then I'm going to head to the White House so I'll catch y'all back up on my way there all right, I just saw the White House. Um, I feel as impressed as I thought I would feel. I'm like, oh cool, oh my God, Obama used to live there. <laughs> Very cool. Where Michelle sleep at? Um, other than that, first of all, it's really far away, so. Second of all, the president don't even live there. I can't even see his toupee blowing the wind nothing at the top yeah I won't even see him like in a window like looking like nothing so I'm just about as excited as I can be about it I guess all right y'all my last stop before I go check in and get some rest is gonna be shops over here on like 15th and something I don't know my way around um, so yeah, I'm gonna go look around, you know, look at a couple of shops, you know, check the scenes. It's so beautiful on this street. I'm on 14th and F. When I say, I feel like I'm in New York a little bit, um, except it's a lot cleaner <laughs> from my point of view anyway. It's been a while since I've been to New York. All right, y'all, I just walked by the cleanest nicest marshals i've ever seen in my life tj maxx is across the street and i don't care what city i'm in oh i'm going to marshals and tj maxx they got the same stuff in all of them but i don't care okay there's really nothing that interesting about me going to marshals and tj maxx so i guess i'm just gonna leave you guys here i hope that you enjoyed this vlog it was a crazy ride because i've slept probably three hours in like the last day um so i really don't know if this vlog was interesting or not but let's see i got off the plane i couldn't check into my hotel i started vlogging Im immediately we saw the washington monument we saw the washington monument we went to african-american museum we saw the white house I'm about to look around a little bit more. I mean, what else do you guys want from me? What else do you want from me, okay? Be happy, be thankful, be grateful, be pimple. Because that's what I have on my face right now. I'm going to let it go. Anyway, I appreciate y'all watching this vlog. As always, you can like and subscribe. And if you really want to do something crazy, you can share this video. Mm, what an insane idea. Thanks for watching. Bye.